Hello, I'm Nathan Judah. I'm here with Express and Star reporter Joe Edwards. Joe, you've been to see Nuno today at Compton Park. What do you have to say ahead of the big game against Middlesbrough tomorrow night? Big game. Big game. Massive game for yourself. Big, game for, big game for your boys. Oh, big game? Yeah, huge, huge game. Huge game. Huge, huge game. game. Big implications. It's, you know, if Wolves win, it's, you know, promotion all but confirmed. Well, it looks like that at this stage, but they've yeah. got to see the job through. Eight games left, of course. Yep, yep, yep. Um, Nuno. It's when, not if, but it's yeah. it could be when very soon. Yes, yes. Tuesday, perhaps, mm, maybe. We'll see, we'll see. Derby. Um, Derby. But um, Nuno keeping things short and sweet. Yeah. As we've uh, you know, as we've come to expect, and we accustomed to. As we're accustomed to, yeah. But he came out with some decent, decent stuff. Um, really delighted that uh, Barry Douglas and um, Matt Doherty got mm. their efforts recognised, both getting their international uh, debuts, of course. Doherty for Ireland and Douglas for Scotland insists you know it's credit to the hard work that they've done with Wolves and he's glad that you know their efforts with Wolves have been recognised that Barry Douglas has been speaking about that as well yeah that he said he thinks it's about eight or nine players uh, that are involved in internationals in some way or another whether it's full internationals or or youth internationals from the Wolves squad he said it's just testament to the work that they've done because mm. Yeah, not many championship clubs will have that amount of players mm -hmm. going away for an international break. Sure. So, uh, you know, Nuno's mm. recognised it to be a tough test against Middlesbrough, saying that a lot has changed for both clubs um, since they met on the opening day of the season. Um, of course, your boys now managed by uh, Tony Pulis. Yes. Um, Tony Pulis. Tony Pulis. Perhaps a bit more direct and a bit more. Go on, so that, that's a very pleasant word to use, direct, a yes. Bit, a bit more direct, a bit more defensive than the were under, under Gary Monk, would he have been on the first? Yes, yeah, yes, yeah, very good, very Monks. good. So, so, I mean, he seems to be popping up everywhere, doesn't he? Mm. But, um, yeah, the, they... Uh, you We've know, got a Dama Traore, he's the main man. He's the, that, that's going to be the battle, Traore versus Douglas. Oh, Douglas is, he's in... International, international, international Barry Douglas. He, he's, he's, he's on top, of, he's on cloud nine, he's, okay, so okay. he's not getting past him. Okay. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, no... The, the the main point really is that everybody's coming back com came back from international duty fine mm -hmm. so the big guns being Neves Douglas and Doherty mm -hmm. they're all fine mm -hmm. Jota still feeling the effects um, of his injury won't be playing against Middlesbrough but could be involved on Tuesday against Hull so so going Costa Cav Costa Cav or Fabi I mm -hmm. think I think you know he can't really change that no um, I, I want to see Leo Bonatini score a goal. <laughs> I think everybody does. I think everybody does. Yeah, you know, for his sake, because he he, lo he looks a great player in the first you know yeah. fifteen games of the season, and then he's just completely gone mm. opposite side of the spectrum now. Oh, I see it. Maybe after after Friday night, <laughs> maybe, well, on, maybe on well, Tuesday. Well, that's it. He f yeah, because I mean, you know, the games are you know it's a pretty pretty short time frame. Yeah, he'll, get, he'll, get, he'll probably get another chance before uh, the end of the season. He'll probably get another chance, mm. but for now. Fabi's got to be the one. He's the one scoring goals. He's the one in, in top form. And yeah, Cavallero and uh, Costa either side of him. That seems to be the way to go. Draw not a better result tomorrow night for Wolves. Or um, I don't think so. Is it four four on the bounce now? Time for Middlesbrough. Mm. Um, so you know it's a tough place to go. Um, of course, you know a long trip. Of, of course, I think they'll probably be making the trip up tonight. I, I suspect or or early or the uh, early tomorrow morning. Mm. So. Um, Tough place to go. I think you would take a draw. I think you would take it going into Hall. That's the game you you targeting all three points from. Yeah. So I think they take four points from this f from four four points from a possible six from these two games. Myself and Tim will be at the Riverside tomorrow night. Should be an interesting one for all the build up on this one. Make sure you log on to expressandstar.com.